What's up everyone? Welcome to the video. My name is Gage Edwards from Waste360.com here today with the top stories for the entire month of August as seen on Waste360.com. It's already freaking September. So let's all grab a pumpkin spice latte and check out these top stories from the last month. Number five, report. Consumers conscious of food packaging lack faith in their recycling. Good Nature published its ready to eat report, detailing concerns consumers have with plastic food packaging and being eco-friendly. According to the report, almost one in three respondents want to recycle their food packaging effectively, but note that they don't know the proper procedures to do so. Number four, staying in the loop. Kevin Green of Waste Connections on leadership in the waste industry. Kevin Green is a leader both in the office and out in the field with his team on the front lines of the waste industry, making sure to stay in the loop of every aspect of his company and putting a face on the hard work he does. And that hard work has paid off professionally inside and out of Waste Connections by earning himself one of Waste 360's 40 under 40 awards. Number three, waste and recycling fire report, achieving the best case from a worst case scenario. With all the focus the waste and recycling industry has put into its fire prevention efforts, why are fire incidents in the waste and recycling facilities still increasing? Be sure to learn all about it in this month's ever knowledgeable fire report. Number two, the 2023 Waste 360 top 50 in waste and recycling. Check out our list that chronicles the 50 largest waste and recycling firms in North America based on 2022 revenues. And our top story of the week, British Columbia's local fix for tire waste. When you think of Ocean Legacy Foundation, you might envision bands of volunteers combing beaches, lifting cigarette butts and empty water bottles with trash grabbing poles. And the Canadian based nonprofit has targeted abandoned tires since its start in 2014. Since 2021, when it began tracking intake data, its crews have removed 4,000 tires from the marine environment, sending them onto processors who give them second lives in many forms. And those were the top stories as seen on Waste360.com for the month of August. It was quite the month with tons of great content so i hope you learned something and with the end of august we're one month closer to waste expo waste expo is happening in may in the popping city of las vegas so you better start packing now you can never be too prepared for travel thanks for watching and i'll see you next time 